Good morning, San Diego, and welcome back. It's the second annual Pine Valley Camp Christmas, and it's transporting guests into a winter wonderland full of holiday fun. And speaking with me about this family-oriented event is Randy Rebold. Good morning, Randy. How good are morning, you? Good morning, Teresa. It's great to be here with you. Thank you. We want to say good morning to everyone in Pine Valley as well. I love Pine Valley. It's, it's a just great place. feels magical right now, kind of like that winter wonderland feel. Yeah, and it's only 30 minutes away from downtown San Diego, so it's just not that tough to get to. But it's like an oasis. It really is. It's a, it's just a whole new world with with pine trees and fresh, crisp air, and it's just great. We love it up there. And tell us about Camp Christmas. Well, Camp you Christmas. You have an amazing list of attractions going on over there. We try to have something for the entire family, and it is a safe, fun environment for families. And we have a computerized light show. We have a computerized water show. We have laser tag. We have a train depot this year for the kids. It's so much fun. Um, we have of course, bounce houses. We have the sugar shack. Uh, one of the favorite things that kids are really enjoying is Sappy, our talking Christmas tree. <laughs> He's just terrific. And uh, last night we had, oh, probably about 400 people that came and uh, we're open for 20 nights, but we're already down. Tonight's the ninth night, so there's still time to come. And people can find their tickets at pinevalleycampchristmas.com. And it's affordable, too. I was looking at the prices. $12 for adults. Yes, and uh, $10 for kids uh, 5 to 15, and kids 4 and under are free. So uh, we really do want to make it affordable and uh, something, again, for the entire family. We have a sugar shack where kids can go in and literally get all the sugar they want and candies. And then we have lots of restaurants, too. We have an Alpine buffet, soup and salad bar. A lot of folks in San Diego will remember the soup plantation. Well, this is our version of it. Eight different soups through the garden salad and then we have a grill that sells hamburgers and other food and a barbecue and it's just wonderful there's just something for everybody we have fire pits for people to do s'mores and uh, then we have a dramatic presentation with a play called the Christmas guest I mean there's just something for everybody How wonderful and events like this bring so much business to the Pine Valley community as you were mentioning well Pine Valley is just a little nook and we're thrilled just to be able to have an opportunity to be an extension of what Pine Valley is all about to the greater San Diego County. Yeah. And it's been a tough couple of years. So this event, it being the second annual, this means everything to the Pine Valley community. Well, we've partnered with them in such a way that um, we allow them to come as often as they like. And um, so we want to, again, be an extension of Pine Valley, but to the greater San Diego community, as people are looking for a fun, safe place to bring their families, to be able to get out for an evening, we're open from 5.30 to 9. And again, we're open tonight and then again next weekend all the way through the 23rd of December. And we'd invite all of our San Diego friends to come and see us. It's a great way to start Christmas. And it's been pretty chilly, so everyone should bundle up when they go. <laughs> Absolutely. You want to dress warm, wear your hats and your, your winter coats. But again, we've got fire pits and indoor activities where people can get out of the cold if they are cold. How wonderful. Should people arrive early and expect long lines? No. Um, well, uh, the gates open at 5, and then we open the gates to the park at 5.30. So if they get there by 5, 5.15, they should be in great shape to enjoy the entire evening. And what was it? Why did you want to start Camp Christmas? You know, um, I'm the director of the camp, and we were just looking, say, what can we do that we're not doing? And I have a background in Christmas production here in San Diego. Years ago, I used to produce a show called The Living Christmas Tree. And okay. uh, so this is kind of an extension of just doing more of the same, of enjoying the Christmas holiday, the true meaning of Christmas, and yet at the same time, offering people just a fun environment where they can go and take their families and have a great night. Oh, this is wonderful. And do you live in Pine Valley? I live there full so, time. So you drove all the way down to Kearney Mesa this morning. Thank you so well, much for it's a doing that. It's pleasure and, and, and an honor to be on your, your broad, broadcast. Okay, well, thank you so much. We will have all the details for Camp Christmas at KWSI.com. Pine Valley Camp Christmas. Pine Valley Camp Christmas. Dot com. Dot com. There you go. Randy, thank you so thank much. You, and Merry Christmas to you and your family. You. Thank you.